whenever you're ready. Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Dear Karen. Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Hey, Karen. 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 Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Karen. Dear Karen. Karen. I remember when I first started as the IMCI coordinator uh, with CORE and you were with BASICS and I would go over and think that I totally understood IMCI and that I had a grisp, grasp on the whole program and then I would go meet with you and it would bring up all kinds of different variables that I hadn't even considered and everything would get more complex. Um, and I remember always being impressed with just how much you knew and feeling like uh, I had a lot to learn from you and was really happy when you came on board with CORE and the work that you did, the involvement, the things that we've worked on together that really brought this organization a long way uh, from the early times doing the appreciative inquiry with CORE group and figuring out all of the budgets and finances and all of that good stuff. It has been 12 years since CORE came into my life, and I still remember the first meeting that I went to in West Point. It took that meeting, and I was hooked and got deeply involved in this organization that I have come to love. It's been a long journey with you it's for almost 11 years um, uh, with CORE. Um, and uh, during this journey, I learned a lot from you, and I'm really grateful for that. And you gave me an opportunity to learn um, so many things. Do you remember the uh, TB workshop that core group organized in India back in 2002 or three? I forget when. Um, it, I had communicated with Anne Hendricks Jenkins about exploring opportunities for me to participate, get a scholarship from CORE to attend the workshop. And um, I didn't make it to the workshop, but that was the first time I heard about Karen LePan and I'd been reading up about all your literature, following all your work, and have been a purely converted Karen fan ever since. Uh, I don't know if you'll remember this, but I remember the first time I met you was October 1, 2007. It was the first day of the Fall Core meeting, which coincidentally was my first day on the job with Adra, and you were just exceptionally approachable and you have remained approachable and eager and open to joint learning. And I really, really appreciate that. With all your technical prowess, I think one thing that sometimes get lost in the shuffle is all your um, skill and ideas you always had for knowledge management and building relationships and connecting people. You always had an idea, some participatory technique or adult learning technique we could kind of put in there, get people to open up and really share. So for everything you did and for all you did to teach us and for everybody to keep them learning, thank you so much. It was great getting to know and working with you and learning from you this past year, especially regarding your expertise in community health and civil society on the ground. I just wanted to tell you how much I learned from you, how much I appreciate you and all that you've done and the, the, way, you, the way you work, the way you interact with people, the way you think. Um, I've absorbed some of that, I'm better for it. Uh, core groups better for uh, your leadership over these years. I would like to thank you for your leadership, um, for the privilege of getting to know you and all of my core friends and colleagues. You have provided extraordinary leadership in very difficult times, uh, navigating us through some shoals of funding uh, desperation and uh, all of the changes that have happened in maternal, child, and community health. You have done an incredible job. The leadership that you brought to this, the expertise, uh, your ability to connect uh, on a technical level with the information and the quality of work, but also know how to connect to different global initiatives, um, and doing all of that in an incredibly collaborative way to really build that uh, feeling of core and the involvement of the members all along the way. Um, you have just been an incredible leader with that. I would like to acknowledge your leadership in bringing core group to where it is now. So many organizations and members, including mine, World Renew, benefited 
from the learning and the networking from core group. Contribution to global health uh, throughout your career has been immeasurable. Your leadership of core group in particular over the last 15 years has built a organization at the heart of everything community health related and it's you we have to thank for for that the core group is such an incredible collaborative space with so many smart people um, and and it's just been such a privilege to be a part of it and it is what it is because of your leadership and vision for so many years thank you for being so nice so caring and so supportive you were like a mother to this organization I know that you truly poured your heart and soul into this organization and your extraordinary passion for maternal and child health really motivated all of us to work harder toward our common goal. I've learned so much from you. I have this incredible debt of gratitude to you. Um, all of my work for the Food Security and Nutrition Network, I don't know where we would have ever been without all the knowledge you were able to share with me. I have a great deal of admiration for you and what you've done at CORE. Uh, making the community-based um, approach and methodology now, I think, the norm for programming uh, MNCH and nutrition. My recent uh, assessment of the Nutrition Portfolio USAID uh, makes it very clear that this is the approach that is being chosen around the world, and appropriately so. You know, I know that no matter where you go and no matter what you do, you will find a way to make a difference and to touch people's lives because that's what you do. I think about all the lives all over the world of people you've touched and I think I'm really grateful that I am one of them. You know, it's because of you giving me the opportunity to come work at Core Group that started me on my path in global health. And I'm always going to be thankful for that. I thank you from the absolute bottom of my heart for taking a chance on me um, and hiring me. And for an amazing three years of being able to work at Core Group, it, it really changed my life. And it really, really um, gave me an opportunity to be involved with um, an amazing group of people, both um, the members at Core Group as well as all the staff. One thing you said to me before I left for Ethiopia sticks with me, and that is uh, you were starting to get a little cynical, one of your reasons for retiring. And I laugh because I've been cynical for at least 15 years, and so I don't know how you start. But I've thought more about it, I've reflected on it, and I think uh, your lack of cynicism has contributed so much to your success. I mean, when you think about what you've achieved over in over 12 years with the core group and all the products that have come out and all the people have been organized to do great work, I think that your lack of cynicism and your faith in humanity and the goodness of, 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 of humans is, is, uh, has been remarkable and has contributed to the huge success you've made. So please remember, you're always going to be there in my heart and when I'm working, I'll be thinking about, hmm, how would Karen respond to this? Over the years, I have come to know you, your commitment and leadership to Core Group, and its growth and recognition among the public health community. I'm confident that Core is positioned well to respond to future needs. Even though we work together for only a short period of time, I think it's very clear that your experience, your knowledge, and your dedication to core group has really had a huge impact on the organization's uh, evolution. Even if I've only been at core for a little less than a year, I can see the passion, collaboration, and hard work the organization possesses and shares among its networks. And I am quite confident that you have been that bright guiding light for it all. I am slowly but surely seeing your legacy and I hope to be able to contribute to its continuation and development. Thank you so much for your leadership of Core Group over the past 14 years. Even though I haven't been here for that long, um, I can see the impact you've made on the organization and our membership and maternal and child health worldwide. And we're excited to continue your legacy here for the future. 
my challenge to you is dare to be bored. Enjoy boredom. Enjoy uh, doing things you wouldn't otherwise do. Uh, they say that boredom is the first step toward creativity and uh, to seeking out new opportunities and so forth. I really can't wait to see what you do next, which might be like sleeping and catching a breath because you deserve it. So all the best and I will see you around. I wish you good health, happiness and success throughout your life. We love you so much and uh, please stay in touch. Bye for now. I wish you the very best over the uh, future years and hope that our paths cross uh, often in, in the future. Take care and be well. And we look forward to your continued contribution with your knowledge, experience and enthusiasm for this work. And I wish you all the best. I want to take the time to wish you the very best in all your future endeavors. Good luck, Carol. You are not our boss anymore, <laughs> but relation would be as a colleague, as a friend, ex-colleague, as a friend. And my family, especially my kids, they love you. We talk about you and they will miss you, we'll miss you. I, I just can't thank you enough um, for all you've done and um, I, I love you. I'm going to miss you very much. Bye. I wish you the best of luck and just remember how grateful we all are for all the work that you've put in over the years. Thank you. I look forward to our future work together and our ongoing friendship. I hope retirement brings you many wonderful things and all the very best with your new adventure. I've really enjoyed working with you and I really miss you a lot. Okay, I'm done. <laughs>